Hello, my plant friends. Welcome to our note taking today. Our last group of classifying plants today in our non flowering plants were the moss, liverwort, and hornwort. So, we're going to take our notes today on those three types of plants. So, come to that non flowering plant section and go ahead and open up to your moss, liverwort, and hornwort section. Now we talked today about, well, how do these plants reproduce? Remember, they're just like a fern and they use spores to reproduce. They use those spores. So very similar to a fern, they release their spores into the air. Moss, liverwort, and hornwort are different from most plants because they do not have roots to anchor them because they're so low and small to the ground and they do not have tubes in the stem. They just go, the, the water does not get transported that way. It just moves around as needed because it is so small and low to the ground. Remember moss is almost like that carpet-like plant Liverwort got its name because the leaves look like the liver of an animal. And hornworts, they look like a horn. And all of these plants are teeny tiny little plants that reproduce with spores and they do not have roots or tubes in the stem. All right, so now this week we talked about classifying and that we group plants based off of their structures. We talked about flowering versus non-flowering plants and that there were three kinds of non-flowering plants, the conifer, fern, and then moss, liverwort, and hornwort. Don't forget to use your notes as you answer your questions this week, including your quiz.